Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. The Curse of Oak Island Preview is the mysterious stone roadway over 500 years old. This week on The Curse of Oak Island, it's all about the stone roadway, and it looks like the guys might have an actual construction date, one that puts it at at least 500 years old. According to one of the show's previews, it looks like the guys have enlisted another expert to have a look at the super mysterious stone roadway in the swamp. He appears to take a quick glimpse before confidently stating, that's 16th century or before. That is exactly the time period the guys would be hoping for. It's long before the initial discovery of the Money Pit of 1795, and it puts it in the same time frame as when Spanish and Portuguese pirates were operating in the Atlantic, meaning there could be loads of booty. It could also be even older. To use one of Gary Drayton's favorite phrases, it could be medieval baby, which could tie into theories that the Templar Knights were burying ancient Christian relics, such as the Ark of the Covenant on Oak Island. Marty Legina is usually seen as the money man and the principal decision maker. However, this week, we see him grab a spade and start digging at the stone roadway. And judging by the preview, he finds something of real significance, we just don't know what it is yet. Oak Island team find artifact linking Samuel Bell to British royalty. In a week where many of us are talking about Prince Harry, Meghan Markle, and the royal family, it seems that we can't even escape the Fuhrer on Oak Island as the History Channel's episode description states. Asterisk looking at the preview, it appears as though the History Channel have mixed up Marty and Rick, as it's the latter who is searching with Gary. Easily done, we've all mixed up the brothers on at least one occasion. Samuel Ball was a freed slave who moved to Nova Scotia after the Revolutionary War and became a farmer and landowner on Oak Island. At the time of his death in the mid-19th century, Ball owned about 100 acres on the island and the mainland. Ball's quite considerable wealth has led some to believe that he may have discovered some of the fabled riches that were supposedly buried on the island. The Oak Island guys have assembled a team led by Laird Niven to examine the ruins around his former house to see if he buried any treasure. Now judging by the episode description, it seems as though Laird has had Gary run his metal detector over the ground, and he's found something intriguing. It's not clear what the object is, but it looks heavy and metallic, and it appears to have some kind of a royal crest on it. Gary seems to think it might have come off Ball's own walking cane, but we'll have to wait for tomorrow night to find out exactly what it is and how it relates to Samuel Ball and the British royalty. What is the Samuel Ball artifact on Oak Island? Of course the hunt for the money pit continues with the deep borehole drilling, and it looks like geologist Terry Matheson has found more wood. Yes, we know. Everyone is getting fed up with finding just wood, but they need to find wood before they can find treasure, and Terry thinks he's identified the corner of a tunnel. At the start of the preview, Rick stated, The story of Oak Island is the real treasure. Fingers crossed, he's totally wrong about that, and there's actually a big pile of gold and silver just waiting to be dug up. Maybe just maybe, this week is the week. The curse of Oak Island has intrigued viewers for years, with its tantalizing secrets buried beneath the surface, ever beckoning treasure hunters to crack the enigma. The upcoming season promises to take this hunt to new, thrilling heights, and one of the most pressing mysteries centers around the island's ancient stone roadway. Could this rugged, carefully laid path be over 500 years old? Could it hold the key to unraveling the mysteries of Oak Island once and for all? The Legina brothers and their dedicated team are no strangers to cryptic discoveries, but the stone roadway uncovered last season has reignited excitement like few other finds in recent years. Extending across the island's swamp, it's more than just a road. It's a puzzle in itself. From the moment they first set eyes on the weathered stones, the team couldn't help but ask, why is it here? And more importantly, who built it? The road feels like a bridge through time, connecting them directly to the shadowy figures who once walked this island. The mystery of the stone roadway deepens when one considers its strategic location. It seems to lead directly to the swamp, a place steeped in its own mysteries. The swamp has been the subject of endless speculation, with many believing it was artificially created to hide something significant, perhaps even the legendary treasure itself. 
Could the road have been used to transport goods, valuables, or even secrets from the shore to a hidden location beneath the murky waters? Or was it a passageway to safety for those who buried something of great value and sought to escape unnoticed? Several historical theories swirl around the island, and this ancient road could be a vital piece of that puzzle. Some speculate that the Templars, with their advanced engineering skills and cryptic ways, could have constructed it while hiding their treasure. Others point to Portuguese explorers, Vikings, or even early Phoenicians. Each theory seems as plausible as the last, especially when placed alongside the remarkable artifacts and symbols already found on the island. Medieval coins, Templar crosses, and even evidence of ancient shipbuilding. In this new season, we're likely to see the team exploring these possibilities with vigor. Expect in-depth carbon dating of organic material found around and beneath the road, along with detailed analysis of the stonework itself. The geological study will be critical too. Could the type of stone give clues as to where it was quarried, or does it contain hidden carvings that could point to a lost civilization or group of explorers? Of course, the discovery of the stone roadway has not only excited the Oak Island team, but also galvanized skeptics and enthusiasts around the world. For the treasure hunters, it's a symbol of hope, a sign that they are on the right track, inching ever closer to the legendary riches that have eluded them for so long. For skeptics, it's another anomaly that could potentially lead to disappointment. After all, the island has a way of turning excitement into frustration, with each new discovery often raising more questions than it answers. But the roadway, unlike some of the island's other curious features, feels deliberate, purposeful. Its weathered stones are carefully laid, suggesting not just the passage of time, but the work of human hands. Whoever built it wasn't just passing through. They were establishing something that needed to last, something important. That sense of importance is what drives the Oak Island team forward, motivating them to dig deeper, probe further, and leave no stone, literally, unturned. Viewers can expect heart-pounding moments as the team comes closer to pinpointing the age of the road. Will the dates line up with the timeline of European exploration, or could it be even older, tied to the island's earliest and most mysterious inhabitants? Each new test result could reveal something shocking, altering the course of the entire treasure hunt. And then there's the question of what lies at the end of the roadway. This season promises to explore the swamp in greater depth than ever before, probing beneath its murky surface for clues hidden for centuries. The connection between the swamp and the roadway feels undeniable, and the team is determined to get to the bottom of it, quite literally. Using a combination of high-tech underwater exploration and good old-fashioned digging, they're gearing up to discover what this road was meant to conceal or protect. In many ways, the stone roadway represents the spirit of Oak Island itself, ancient, mysterious, and stubbornly silent. It doesn't give away its secrets easily, but it does suggest a deeper history, one that goes beyond mere folklore and pirate tales. Could this be the season when the Laginas finally connect all the dots, uncovering the story of who built the road and why? Whether you're a seasoned treasure hunter or a curious new viewer, the upcoming season promises to be one of the most thrilling yet. The ancient stone roadway stands as a tantalizing lead in the search for Oak Island's secrets. One thing is certain, as the team gets closer to unearthing its true purpose, they'll also come closer to understanding the island's ultimate mystery. Is this roadway the key to unlocking the 500-year-old secret of Oak Island? Only time and a lot of digging will tell.